Hi, what's up guys? This is my second video on my project car, Project Germany. Okay, the first thing that I want to do in my project car is that I want to fix it up because this is the purpose of buying a used car is that you're using it while you're fixing it. That is the life of buying a car. Okay, now, the first thing that I want to do with my car is that I want to fix the anything related with the engine, the transmission and anything with suspension also. Uh, and the second part is that I want to fix is the appearance part which is the paint, the wheel, anything and last is about the electronic which is the radio and all such thing okay without further ado let's continue with my first video and then that is to fix it up so let's go What's up guys, in this video, I will show you guys how to change a Mercedes spark plug. You guys better stick around to the end of this video, I will show you guys how much does it cost to replace a spark plug on this Mercedes. If you guys don't know what is a spark plug, here I show you a picture of a spark plug here. As we all know, an engine needs air and fuel mixture to work, but it also needs spark plug to produce the explosion. Here. I show you guys an illustration of a working engine. As you can see, air and fuel are mixed and when they are compressed, the spark plug ignites using an electric electrical current to produce the explosion. Here also I show you guys a picture of how the spark plug works. Here are the symptoms of a bad spark plug. Your engine will run poorly, you have misfire, hesitation and bad fuel economy. For this Mercedes, the spark plug code already printed at the chassis of front bonnet. As you can see here, there are three types of compatible spark plug for this Mercedes engine. Now let me show you guys how to replace a spark plug on this Mercedes engine. Let's go! To unclamp the throttle body and the air duct, you need to remove the clamp by using 6mm socket. You need to take off the breather engine hose. For the mass airflow sensor, you just need to unclip it and done. Now you need to remove the top cover by using head bits. Now we can open this up. Woo, look at that. To remove the plug coil, you need to unbolt this 10 mm nut. And for this two, you need to take it off really, really hard to pull it out. To remove the oil spark plug in your engine, you need a socket, a deep thin wall 16mm socket with an extension and a ratchet.
after you loosen the old spark plug in your engine you need to pick it up using magnet pickup Look at this old spark plug, it's worn out. Here is the comparison between an old spark plug and a new spark plug. Honestly, I'm glad I'm doing this replacement job because the old one all worn out. Inside, just throw it down. Okay. Use a very long. Put it in there. Make sure. Sorry, the hand tighten. Okay. To install your new spark plug in your engine, you need to use a torque wrench and torque it down to 28 newton meters. And from here basically is the reverse order of what I've shown it to you. You have to put all this plug coil back, tighten it back, put the top cover and place the air duct back. And you finish. If you're wondering where I buy this stuff, buy this new spark plug and all the tools, I'll share a link down below so you can go and buy it for yourself. For cost breakdown analysis, each spark plug cost me around 8 ringgit only. Total, I need to do on this replacement job, I need 4 spark plug plus. The grand total of this replacement job is only 32 ringgit only. Say goodbye to this old spark plug. So thank you guys for watching, don't forget to subscribe, leave a comment down below and do tell me how much does it cost to replace a spark plug on your vehicle, share down in the comments down below.
If you not a subscriber, please consider subscribing because more video are coming. So please subscribe and enjoy. Stay tuned. Thank you guys for watching and peace.